myself and uh, I learned some pretty good new tricks. So, <laughs> what I thought I'd do is share one of them with you now. I'd like to show you a trick, but then I'm going to teach you exactly how the trick is really done. Sounds fun? Yeah. Let's do it then. It is a trick using one of these, a red handkerchief. And like all great magic, it is very simple. All you've got to do is take the red handkerchief and poke it down into your fist. Then wave a mysterious wave. Snap and you'll have an egg. The handkerchief itself, of course, jumps back to my pocket. And that is the trick. Now I'm going to teach you how it works. All you need are two handkerchiefs and one of these. A fake egg, isn't it stupid when you know how? <laughs> now it may seem simple, but I'm going to go back to the beginning and teach you exactly how to do it in case you want to show your friends. Walk up to your friends and announce you are about to perform an amazing illusion. Enjoy this moment, because when you start doing magic, you don't have friends for very long. <laughs> take out the red handkerchief, but at the same time, secretly take out your fake egg. This, by the way, is what magicians call palming. Then take hold of the handkerchief and with the same hand as the fake egg, and wave it around. This is what magicians call misdirection. Then secretly pass the fake egg from one hand to the other. This is what magicians call secretly passing the fake egg <laughs> from one hand to the other. Not everything has a cool name. Once you've passed your fake egg, which is not nearly as painful as it sounds, <laughs> wave and snap, reveal the egg, and at the exact same time, reach down into your pocket and take out the second handkerchief. That is why you need two, but it is very important that they are the same color. Now, <laughs> at this point, be careful, because you may accidentally show people the back of the egg. They'll see the handkerchief sticking out. The trick's over. It's ruined, especially if there are kids. Kids sometimes shout out. They say, hey, that's a fake egg. <laughs> They're not very subtle. <laughs> that's easy to handle, especially in England. Let's say, for instance, you're a kid. Just shout out, hey, there's a fake egg. Shut your face, kid. What's it got to do with you anyway? <laughs> but we're in Chicago. These kids could be related, connected. You know what I mean? I'd be scared. I say, okay, fine. I say, I may have a fake egg, but I'm a real magician. 